Hey guys, it's Gwendolyn with iFixit, and today we're at Mini Maker Faire in San Luis Obispo, California. Maker Faire is about learning, doing, and of course, making. There's amateur tinkerers, and you know iFixit's here. I can't wait to learn something new today. Let's get making. I'm here with Dr. Lear with Mini Maker Faire in San Luis Obispo. Tell us a little bit about Mini Maker Faire and what you do for it. So um, I've been involved in organizing this year's Maker Faire. Um, there are a group of us who've been working since about November um, to start the planning for everything that we have today. And so it is amazing to be here and see it actually happening. I'm here with Brian. Brian, who are you here with? I'm here with Innovation Sandbox. Yeah, and tell us what you guys do. Well, we are a club for focused for entrepreneurship and innovation. Okay, with Cal Poly, right? With, with through Cal Poly, correct. Okay, great. And uh, what did you guys bring today to Mini Maker Fair? Well, we brought a few things. We brought uh, first off is a 3D printer uh, maker bot. We also brought a banana piano. So a banana likely, piano. Most likely, you've never pl probably played a banana piano. No, I've never played a b banana. Well, I mean, today's your lucky day. We have a, a little circuit board here, which is attached for a few ports. And it runs a program that was basically installed on the computer itself. Okay. So all you simply does is connect, complete the circuit, and it triggers a reaction which com which plays a certain key. Thank you. Thank you. I'm here with Tracy, and Tracy, who are you with? I'm here with Cal Poly IEEE Club. We're the uh, Cal Poly Club for Computer and Electrical Engineering. And we're just basically teaching people how to solder. Um, over here, we're making solder art just like this. Uh, we have a whole bunch of obsolete components. And so we figured teach people how to solder and make art out of it. I'm here with Jeff, and Jeff is a maker. Jeff, what do you make? I make cookie tin ukuleles. That's so much fun and colorful. So tell me the first time you made one of these. Uh, well, a friend of ours uh, sent us a, an actual ukulele from uh, Hawaii uh, for as a wedding gift, and then I had to make a cigar box uke, and then I saw a photograph of somebody who had made a, a uke out of a cookie tin, and I had to try it myself. So are you going to play something for us? <laughs> okay, you're putting me on the spot. All right. So this is, this is a, 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 a very hillbilly song. I'm ready. Go for it. Most folks will never eat a skunk, but then again, some folks will. Like Cletus, the slack jawed yoko. That was amazing. Hey guys, we're here with Tyler and Evan, and they are with... Cal Poly Physics Department. That's very fun. And what have you made today? We have a couple of shuffler concentrators today. And that's what's behind me right now. What are we going to do with it today? We're going to cook some food on it. What do I get to cook? <laughs> Uh, you can cook a hot dog or an egg. Up to you. I think I'm going to cook an egg. All right. Can you see this? This is pretty hot. This might actually make me want to cook. Okay, Evan, tell us how it works. Okay, well, really, it's a single-axis solar concentrator. So we take it outside and aim it north, and then you just set it to the east so it is aimed kind of at the sun, and it charges up a little cell, okay. and then it gets enough power for the motor to run, and it just tracks from east to west throughout the day. So how quickly does it heat up? Um, pretty much instantly, actually, instantly. yeah. Order up. One of the things I'm really excited about this year, when we think about making um, and technology and making and the sort of maker movement, sometimes people just think about robots or they think about soldering. And those are key parts of the maker revolution in the United States. But it's also about integrating, you know, the new technologies like 3D printing with um, traditional crafting um, and other art practices um, and really con combining the sort of science, technology, arts, mathematics approach. And so I'm really excited that we have more and more uh, diverse people here at this year's Maker Faire. And I can't wait to see who we'll get next year.
And that's 2014's Mini Maker Fair in San Luis Obispo, California. Thanks for joining us. Keep tinkering and keep making. And remember, it's not about the finished product. It's about getting your hands dirty and doing it.